Good evening, everyone. Should Missouri public school teachers and students be allowed to discuss homosexual issues in school? Some Missouri lawmakers say no. It's something called the Don't Say Gay Bill. It would prohibit the discussion of sexual orientation in public school instruction, material, or extracurricular activity. The only exception would be in health classes. It's a story that is generating a lot of emotion and discussion, the issue of homosexual discussion in public schools. Holly Brantley spent the day talking with people on both sides. She joins us live at 6 with more and Holly, what are they saying? Jeff, we found out this is a sensitive subject with lots of opinions on both sides. We talked to Christians, students, parents and homosexuals about the issue. I thought it was the most ridiculous bill I've ever heard of. James Francis serves as president of the Southeast Missouri State University Gay Straight Alliance. He's well aware of House Bill 2051, known as the Don't Say Gay Bill. I would just really like everyone to know that this bill is going to be hurting a lot of individuals in the area. It's a one sentence bill that would ban discussion of sexual orientation in public schools. No instruction, material or extracurricular activity. Francis feels it's a step in the wrong direction in his fight for equal rights. I, I think it's exactly the opposite because, you know, we want to see more talks happening in schools. He feels lack of education leads to discrimination. If it were a choice, why would I choose to be bullied and harassed on a daily basis? However, we found some people who agree with lawmakers, including some parents who say it's a talk they'd like to have with their kids. Especially when it deals with sexuality, I do definitely think that it's something that should stay in the home. Um, I don't necessarily see that being the school's responsibility to take care of something like that. Christians also feel strongly about the bill. Well, according to the Bible, it does teach that homosexuals is an abomination. Well, I'm against homosexuals altogether. If passed, 2051 would only allow for discussion when it comes to scientific instruction concerning human reproduction. If we ban homosexuality, what are we going to ban next? African American history, Latino history. Many people we spoke with feel homosexuals have the right to be upset. I think they would feel like they were being ostracized from our community. I mean, why shouldn't your kids be able to be taught that it's okay to be different? Because I have friends that are homosexual. I have family that's homosexual. And to get rid of that, it's just, it's just wrong. Others say government has gone too far. I mean, politicians get tied up in a lot of things, and it's, it's sometimes, it, to me, it seems like whoever makes the biggest stink gets, gets the time devoted to their issue. The bill sponsor is Steve Cookson of the 153rd District, representing several Heartland counties. We have contacted his office for comment. Meanwhile, the bill is not scheduled for a hearing in the near future, and session ends mid-May. It's been assigned to the House Elementary and Secondary Education Committee for discussion. Live local late-breaking, Holly Brantley, Heartland News.